Hello everyone, my name is James and welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to be discussing whether Red Bull's engine could be down on power for the upcoming 2022 season. Now if you enjoy the video make sure to leave a like and also subscribe for more Formula 1 content and if you want to follow me on Twitter you can at James underscore Formula 1 and there'll be a link in the description. But without further ado, Let's jump straight into the video. So Red Bull have been using Honda engines since 2019, but in October 2020, Honda announced it would be leaving the sport at the end of the 2021 season. Although earlier on in the year, agreed a deal for Red Bull and AlphaTauri to continue using Honda power units until 2024. But with the Japanese manufacturer having now left the sport, Red Bull have formed a new company, Red Bull Powertrains Limited, to run the project, with the new division being operated from Red Bull's base in Milton Keynes. Now we know the Honda engine is very strong. For starters, Red Bull won the Drivers' Championship with it in 2021 and narrowly missed out on the constructors. One of the key reasons the power units were so strong was because of an upgraded battery that was introduced during the season. This helped with energy efficiency and it was also light, therefore reducing weight and this results in better chassis performance as it allows for better weight reduction. While the Honda engine isn't as good as the Mercedes one, it definitely made the right steps in 2021 to take further leaps forward. Now, while the regulations are being changed for 2022, and this will see a total revamp of the cars, one element that remains unchanged is the power unit. However, the development for it will be frozen from 2022 onwards, meaning that teams and manufacturers are scrambling to ensure their engines are as good as they can be ahead of the upcoming season. Now, while Honda may have left the sport, they are still helping Red Bull with their RB18's performance ahead of the freeze, according to Red Bull advisor Dr. Helmut Marko. But while the performance of the Honda engine improved in 2021, Marco says it's not quite the same yet for 2022. Speaking to Auto Motor and Sport, he said, Honda is working massively to adapt. What I hear is positive, but the performance is not yet the same as 2021. But you will generally have to wait and see how it looks in race trim. Now, one of the reasons performance might not be the same is due to the new fuel that is being used this season. Teams are moving to a new E10 fuel, and according to reports, as much as 20 horsepower could be lost amid the new change. So right now, the engine might be lacking a bit of power as the team try and overcome that. Other than that, the 1.6 litre hybrid engines aren't changing, apart from there being some more standard components in the fuel system. And with Honda essentially handing over their engine to Red Bull while also apparently still helping out a bit, Red Bull will know the ins and outs of that engine and will know how to make the most of it. So I can't see what else would be hindering its performance at the moment. I mean, the only other thing that may be hindering performance is that the Honda engine may not be working in full harmony with the car yet. After all, it's getting a total design change and will be different to drive. Therefore, more work may be needed to get the two working in sync. But guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. But that's going to be the video from me today. Thank you ever so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And until the next one, take care.